Wash. What else are you going to put on? Do you have eyeshadow? No. Oh, we have to get you some eyeshadow. Can I shadow? I don't know, maybe some some real. Oh, pretty barrette. Real ones? Maybe so. What do you think? Yay, real shadow. Yeah. I like real shadow. Hi, ladies and gents, if any are watching. I thought I'd come to you today and share with you some of my favorites that I have been loving lately. So we'll just get started. First I'm going to start with some body wash. Um, Tammy at Uppy's Beads 59 turned me on to these. This is um, Nubian Heritage Goat Milk and Chai Body Wash and I got the soap. It is, smells wonderful. I love it and it really feels good on my skin. Um, I, my local Whole Foods store carries the Nubian Heri Heritage brand but not very many flavors so I ordered these on Amazon. Got several backups of the soap and the and this because it really I just really like how that smells and then we'll move on to some hair stuff uh, matrix biolage exquisite oil uh, tamaru oil I think is what it is I, I really am enjoying that and loving that it really makes my hair feel soft and it helps a lot of the frizz I think uh, I put it in some you know like before I blow dry it um, and then I put some on afterwards just kind of run it through through the ends and we'll go over to some skincare this dermalogica pre cleanse I, I'm really lo I'm really loving this it's when I feel like my skin needs some extra cleansing to get in all the crevices and all that all the yucky stuff I really like using this. Uh, you put it on dry, and rub it through, and really massage it through your, you know, in your skin. Then you wet your fingers and you start rubbing it, and then it gets like, like a milky wash. It emulsifies. So I really like this. Um, I don't know if after I finish this up, if I would, if I would repurchase because it's thirty-eight dollars a bottle, and I kind of like to research maybe some more. Um, different ways to use oils like maybe baby oils and things like that to cleanse my skin so but I'm, I'm really enjoying that and I like this Thayer's Lavender Witch Hazel uh, toner it's alcohol free I use that in the evenings after I've cleansed my face to make sure there's no more makeup on there Angie at a hot and flashy she got me turned on to that stuff. So this Queen Helen olive oil mask for your face. Got this at Sally's. I'm enjoying that. That is very nice and it's not very expensive and and um, I can't remember what it was. Sorry, but I, I really I'm enjoying that. Earth Therapeutics Foot Repair Therapeutic Balm. I believe I got this at um, TJ Maxx or Marshalls smells good I like the way it smells I like the way it feels on my feet I put it on at night before I go to bed put on those little socks that have like lotion in them as well I put this on and put the socks on and my feet you know it's really helping a lot of the rough rough areas on my feet then before I go to bed at night I'm liking this endless glove soap and glory but I'm really enjoying this I put that on at night and it really is helping my hands. It just feels good. And it ma makes my hands feel really soft. It feels good in the, in the morning. Another thing I'm really loving. I really like these EOS um, balms, lip balms. This one is coconut milk. And oh my goodness. It smells like a pina colada on your lips. It, I really, really like that. I have several of these around in, in, in my basket where I have my... Um, skincare stuff this is this is really really nice I enjoy the smell of this and 
just about a month ago, well, just recently, whenever this came out, I got this uh, CC cream, the IT CC cream and the Illumination. I'm liking this. Uh, this is, I have the regular and light that I kind of used before I started getting any, any sun on my face. This is medium. I don't think it's too dark. That's what I have on now. I don't know. It, it didn't seem like it was too dark, but I'm really enjoying this. I like the uh, IT Cosmetic CC cream. And so. this, the Benefit Roller Lash. Mascara. I'm really loving that. I like that. And the Too Faced Melted Lip Balm Cream stuff in in a Chihuahua. I like that. I love Too Faced products. And of course, I uh, I just got this recently in my last video. I showed you that I had it in the haul. The lip injection by Too Faced, and I I put. That's what I have on now, the Chihuahua. Oh, but I did put some Buxom right. I guess I'm a glutton for punishment because I put this on. Then I put the Buxom on, which it's got the little stingy stuff too, the nice stuff. And then I put this over top of that. And um, I really like that. And uh, this candle. Let's switch it up here, house stuff. This candle by Candleberry. It's Vanilla Orange Crush really 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 nice smell I think it started out you can tell I've used quite a bit of it it's almost gone I keep it burning all the time but I, it, I believe it's it started out with the vanilla part on top and then we're down I'm down to the orange and it really has a nice you know to, to burn to burn this like during now during this the warmer months I really like this smell I'm enjoying that and I have to share this with you the icebreakers ice cubes and grape I love this this gum it is just, I, I I really like it I, it's that and this diet grape soda from Meyer we have the grocery store here called Meyer it's like the Walmart I'm not for sure you know if you all have if you've seen a Meyer but this is their brand I usually drink coffee and tea, and I try to stay away from uh, diet drinks. I don't, you know, but I can't help it. This is like a dessert to me. It is really, I really enjoy it. So I've got it here with me to, to sip on. Start watching on Netflix, and I binge watched, watched this uh, new series called uh, Bloodline. I really enjoy that. What's really cool is that there's a character in there. He's DEA, DEA agent Clay Grunwald, and his name is Bill Kelly, and I graduated high school with him. And it's so cool to see someone you know and you went to school with in, in something like this. So I'm re I really enjoy, enjoy that. And I've watched all of them already. And I'm enjoying, of course, Outlander. That's on the Stars channel. And if I didn't have Jamie in my life, I didn't again what I do. And, th and now, I rented off of iTunes not long ago. I know I'm behind on watching movies, but I rented this mo movie, a Brad Pitt movie called uh, Fury. Oh my goodness. It was amazing. Keep your tissues handy. Well, I cried, but I cried Hallmark commercials, but I really enjoyed this movie. I recommend that one. And the books I'm reading right now, I usually keep a book uh, in print reading, and then I listen to uh, audible.com. I have books on that because every weekend we go to the farm, and it's about an hour and 15 minutes away, and um, I keep one on Audible so I can listen to and the one I'm listening on to Audible right now, I'm on the, the third book of the Outlander series called Voyager. And the person that narrates these books, if you anybody watch, listens to any um, Audible books like this, she's amazing. The accents, it's just so enjoyable to listen to her. Um, but, uh, that's what I'm re reading on Audible. And I'm reading another one of Adriana Trigiani's, I'm probably not pronouncing her name right, I just started the Big Stone Gap series. I have read, uh, oh gosh, I love The Shoemaker's Wife and the Valentine series. So many of her books. And I just picked these, uh, I think there's three, there's now four, I believe. 
that's out in this. I picked them up at the Half Price Bookstore. And I started reading that, and and uh, I'm loving it so far. I haven't finished it yet, so but I'm loving the it. Most favorite thing that I have been loving lately, and that is the community of ladies on YouTube. It, it is amazing. I, I I'm having so much fun, and um, let me start. I've always watched YouTube and watching different things and learning different things and somehow uh, I started watching some skincare videos and I think the very first one that I ran across was Angie at Hot and Flashy and uh, she's very knowledgeable you know showing you know the reviews that she does and and her skincare routines I, I copied a lot of her stuff and you know got you know picked up a lot of things that she she uses and and um, so and sometime I think at one point she uh, mentioned Tammy Miss Tammy at Uppy, uh, Uppy's Beads 59. Well, I went over to her channel to check out her videos. Well, oh my gosh. I, I tell you, I, I could not get away from the computer for watching one after another. I learned so much about skincare from her too, and hair care, and the, and the smoothies, and I just would keep watching and watching her videos. It, it's just, it was my entertainment. Uh, no TV, just that. And uh, so, when I got to the, I saw that the last one she did was in like I think last November, and I was like, oh man, I wish she would start because I think I started watching them in March or February. Well, the first of this year or so, and um, and I was like, oh, I wish Tammy would make some more videos. And it, you know, the last one she made said she was out and taking a break. And well, one night I had I had it on my I had it notify me whenever certain videos are popped up on YouTube, and my phone was beside my bed and. And it's about one or two o'clock in the morning, and I was just, I think I just had fallen asleep. And my phone dinged. And I picked it up, and I looked at it, and it said, Uppy Speeds 59 has just up uploaded a video. I hopped out of that bed, and I ran downstairs, and I opened, it was a 30-minute video, her, mate, her uh, empties. And, oh my gosh, I was so excited to, to uh, see that. You know, to see that she had put one up. And, um, and then I commented. For the first time, I'm thinking yeah, there's no way, you know, she, you know, she would comment back or anything, and sure enough, she did, and I was like, I, I was so excited that she commented back to me. It was like a rock star or or some celebrity had, uh, you know, sent, you know, sent a message to me. So th that started my YouTube addiction, and but then I started and also found on O Carol. Uh, Carol with the O'Carroll Show, the list of uh, all the ladies, the mature ladies of YouTube, and of course I went there every single one of them, and I went to their channels and watched them and subscribed, and and the knowledge and it just everything that I was learning, it was it was just wonderful. When I would read the comments that all the ladies would leave to each other, and and I, and, and I could feel the the love and and the friendships, and I just wanted so much to be a part of that, just. I retired about a year ago, about a year and a half ago, and no kids are at home. And so when you're retired and you're, and I've worked like since I was 16, and you know, I was like out of touch with the outside world. And I didn't realize how much, you know, there was something, you know, things were, you know, I have friends and I see them, I'm in a book club. So, but I was just missing missing something and I just wanted so much to be a part of this because I just the community and the 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 bonds and the friendships is just it was just amazing amazing I just want to say a great big thank you to the community of these wonderful ladies for welcoming me with so much warmth and the, the encouragement the support thank you for your knowledge uh, not only on beauty and skincare and thank you Mary on your um, on your um, your IT help all your computer help but I thank you for your friendships and being there for me when I needed it and thank you for to all my subscribers out there I'm having so much fun I, I am making so many friends and I'm just loving it I really I appreciate each and every one of you and that's all I wanted to say, and thanks. Thanks again. So, I hope you enjoyed my favorites. I'll see you in the next video. I love you all. Bye.